Well, Gareth Southgate now has stepped down as England manager and the search for his successor is underway. Already the FA commenting through Mark Bullingham saying that they will begin the process immediately. Uh, but it, will, it may take time and there's already an interim-based option uh, there for them if they want to take that. So that suggests that they're prepared to wait for the person that they want to take over in the hot seat. So and now that the European Championships are over, you know, it's apparent that England were always probably going to have to win it for Southgate to stay. Uh, he probably had the option to remain uh, with the FA, but ultimately he's taken the decision to step down because he probably believes he can't take them any further. And stinging criticism after the 2-1 defeat against Spain. It was a tough night for England. I thought they battled hard still. I thought they were still pushing for a result in the closing stages, having one cleared off the line. Could have even gone to extra time and, and you never know. But ultimately now, England searching for that new boss. There's already a few names being thrown around. Obviously, the, the one that Newcastle fans are concerned about, Eddie Howe, uh, Graham Potter's involved as well, uh, Mauricio Pochettino. There's calls for Jurgen Klopp. It's going to be really interesting to see who the FA go for. Newcastle fans will be hoping it's not Eddie Howe, uh, but it depends if, if that offer comes on the table for him. We'll have to wait and see. As I say, uh, Mark Bullingham making it clear that uh, they're prepared to wait, but potentially by offering somebody the job on it or caretaker basis. Could that be Lee Carsty, the under-21 boss? We'll have to wait and see. But look, England uh, looking for a new manager. Newcastle United have started pre-season training under Eddie Howe. The timing is not ideal. We'll have to wait and see exactly how it unfolds.